Welcome to the Buy Manufacturers Direct YouTube Surface Preparation Learning Series, where today Josh first utilizes a Mohs hardness scratch test to determine the concrete hardness, and based on that information, experiments with two different types of diamonds, while demonstrating a few tricks of the trade to extend the life of any diamond. This video shows a well-trowed slab, which is in need of diamond grinding. The first tool chosen is a 30 grit, 10 seg, medium bond diamond. Josh's first trick is to broadcast a light layer of silica quartz, which keep the diamonds cool, allowing them to cut more efficiently for longer periods of time. Next, using a common pump sprayer, Josh sprays a light water mist. They appear to do well quickly opening the slab. However, after 30 minutes, their speed of cut has slowed. A tool change is necessary, switching to a 2530 two-segment medium bond diamond and after 25 minutes of work, it's demonstrated to be the right choice. It commonly happens where diamond tools cut great when new, but their production slows and tapers over time. Ruling out quality issues, the loss of production can be contributed to a cumulative effect of exposure to heat and contaminants. The heat is built up from friction and the contaminants are scraped from the concrete. To limit the frustrations that performance decline instigates, it's best to determine the correct tool and weight. Remaining open to change, though, will help cue a switch as soon as the process appears to be slowing. This concludes this Buy Manufacturers Direct Learning Series segment. To learn more about any of the products or processes used in today's video, please reach out to your Buy Manufacturers Direct customer support representative. And as always, if you found today's video informative, we invite you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And please don't forget to select the bell icon to be notified when we post a new video.